In 1982, in a hard rock haze of drugs and booze, Ozzy Osbourne was about to commit a veritable Ozfest of notorious acts, starting with one night in Des Moines, Iowa. He was on the tour and somebody threw a bat onto the stage. What he perceived to be one of these plastic bats that you get in toy shops. And Ozzy bent down, picked it up, and bit his head off. It turned out that it wasn't a plastic bat, it was a real one. I don't think he'd have done it on purpose, because bats carry rabies, and he ended up having to have rabies injections for the next 30 days, which are nasty injections through the muscles of the stomach wall. Now, how many days did you have to take the shots, the rabies shots, after the uh, bat incident? I'm still under, um, I'm still under observation, you know. Almost immediately, a, a, a bunch of Chinese whispers started, where people were thinking he was sawing the legs off of dogs and throwing them at the crowd, and the RSPCA were after him. Just about every organization you can imagine in America was after him. <laughs> But worse was to come, when Ozzy got caught short and relieved himself on the Alamo, thus insulting the sacred memory of Davy Crockett. I do things on the spur of the moment. Whatever I do, I don't even think about it. I don't even think where I am or what I do. I mean, you're kind of crazy in the head and do, do these things. And apparently he used to go to the toilet wherever he felt like it. Singer Ozzy Osbourne thinks it's fun to defile public shrines. He says his greatest ambition is to turn the steps of the White House into a public restroom. And the papers will have gone nuts. Everyone wanted to string him up. It's surprising to get a posse chasing him out of town and hanging the guy. Shockingly, 20 years later, drug-addled Ozzy is the living embodiment of modern family values. He even has friends in high places. What a fantastic audience we had tonight. Washington power brokers. Celebrities, Ozzy Osbourne. Hey. No, 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 here, here's the truth. Ozzy not would. You can be done for manslaughter. He's going to the side of the house. Ozzy! Too low to the window. What a fantastic audience we had tonight. Washington power brokers, celebrities, Hollywood stars, Ozzy Osbourne. You write in the book, let me read to you this quote. Over the past 40 years, I've been loaded on booze, coke, acid, quaaludes, glue, cough syrup, heroin, Ropinol, ro, Rohypnol, Clonopin, Vicodin, and too many other heavy-duty substances to list. On more than a few occasions, I was on all of those at the same time. So my first question, obvious one, how are you alive? I don't know. It's a miracle. Miracles do happen, don't they? This guy came up, he looked like a haystack Calhoun. I mean, this guy had overalls on, had to be like 6'8", you know mountain man with a big ass beard and the whole nine yards <laughs> he had red lipstick on <laughs> and he just goes to Oz he goes Oz I love all your records man I, I love you you don't know how much I love you and Oz like oh that's great he goes do you mind if could you give me a kiss <laughs> and Oz goes yeah. no so it's like no but Zach will. <laughs> <laughs> oh it's legless with a bottle of Corbusier in my hand at nine o'clock in the morning I wanted to take a pee so I find this old wall and I've got this green evening dress on. I'm standing there having a leak. And this guy goes mental, this deputy marshal or whatever. And goes, there he is. And I was dressed in a morning of my wife's evening, green evening dress. He's urinating up the fing Alamo. Ozzy sees a popsicle stick laying on the ground and there's a long trail of ants going to it. And he gets down on his knees and he goes. All this snorting ants one that they found me drunk snorting ants on this thing. I mean, crazy stuff. And uh, we're like going, oh, dude, that's, that dude's f crazy. I drank a bottle of co cognac, I think, and a load of other crap. And that's Sharon's smell. I want you to go in there and make a, an impression and throw these doves in the air. I said, yeah, I'll make an impression. And the bird landed on Ozzy's knee. And he picked it up and put it in his mouth and ripped its head off. There was a little bit of blood dripping from, from his, his lip, and I was, I was quite horrified by it. And, uh, and there's all these smiling people going, 
this carcass was flapping around the table and feathers were flying in the air and they were all like throwing up all over the place. It was quite quite interesting to see these office people with the ties and this little puke thing in the front of them. <laughs> Ozzy, can you breathe? Ozzy, you got the keys! Don't worry, just take one of the f***ing pipes! Ozzy, can you breathe? Ozzy! Ozzy! Someone get back and get an ambulance. Get an ambulance to the house. We came home from the restaurant. I was downstairs, he was up. Suddenly he comes downstairs a couple of hours later. He's got his underpants on. I thought he was ready for bed. And suddenly he just said, we've made a decision. And I'm like, we've? Mm. Yes, and you've got to die. And I'm like, OK, all right. And so what did he do then? Um, he lunged on me and, you know, got me down to the floor and started strangling me. How close did it get? Um, pretty damn close. Pretty damn close. And that, that was like someone putting a red hot poker through the middle of my spine. You know, it was like, you know, I, I, that was my worst. And that's st still that didn't stop me. Evidently threw an unconscious bat on the stage, and he thought it was a rubber bat, whatever, and he picked it up and bit the head off. And Sharon's going. Dummy, it's real. I don't need that much. Go on, there. Just, just tell you. you, you can... Do I really don't need this stuff? Well, I'd rather you have some cash than you have none. Another thing. Several safe times. I will. Rock and roll, Cal. If you catch a case of Corona, let me know. Can, can you take this photograph for us? Yeah. Right, guys, one, two. You gotta put, I'll, get, I'll get you a bottle of water. Just sip on the water. I've got it. that interview on the phone. And on the phone? Uh, she's holding on. I had to hang up, so I was throwing up. Right, let, me get, let, me get, let me get you a bottle of water. <sighs> Hi, Sylvia. Sorry. See, it was me who said, hey, Kelly, when she was used to hang out the mall with a little stupid friend, I said, Kelly, come meet us some clothes, we'll hang out. Yes, Jack, I really, I really understand, but you've got to understand where I'm coming from. I love you all. I love you more than life itself. But you're all fucking mad. Dad, this is Brianne. She lives in Courtney. Nice to meet you. I met your brother, Kurt, on a couple of occasions. It's cool. You don't eat that shit, it's fucking poison. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, hey, hold on. Got it. Got a spark before it's lit. Oh, Give me no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, 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 no, we need, we need to wait. We need to wait. Let's do the big one. We're not going to do the big one. Let me see this time bomb you have. Which one? The big one? That's the old man's trying to do it. I don't know. I got a problem with this. I don't want this. Okay. okay. Yo, yo, yo. No Thank you very much, Kevin. Of course. No problem. And throw the fucking thing. Do me a favor. Yep, just throw it away. Just throw the fucking thing away. <laughs> just throw the No, I'm telling you. I'm telling your father. I'm telling you. Throw the fucking thing over the side. Please, now. No Dump the fucking huh? thing. Yeah, Go on. Thank you very much. How much I'm going to Vegas and getting married. Just for the hell of it. I'm, I'm telling you, I will get married in Vegas. I'm not kidding. I know you will, Kelly. I'm serious. I'm going to marry someone before Christmas. Oh, do it, Kelly. How exciting. I'd love a good wedding now. <laughs> I know, seriously. <laughs> I would. I'd love it. Please. I'm serious. And get man. pregnant. I don't know why so the pregnant thing. I can have thing. the baby. Guess what, Dad? I'm going to get married before Christmas. Good for you. <laughs> I'll take my walk. No, Dad. You can't walk. Dad, walk. Oh, I'll take it. Dad, Dad will take 
No, I'll take the dog for a walk, because if I don't take the dog for a walk, you don't ever go for a walk. You'll be looking at the fucking television and nothing around. I'll take the dog for the fucking walk, okay? Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? You're running like an idiot. Jack, that's really rude. I don't care, I'm just as it, I'm just fucking crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that was hard. Yeah. Yes, Mum. Could you please get the song to go with it? Mum, what do you think I just tried to say? He's yeah. stoned. Can you. Is he singing? What kind of. Ah, fuck off. I think I got them revved up today, don't you think? Do you got them all revved up today? Thanksgiving, fuck, I hate it. Dad, I hate Jack. What do you say? What do you say about him? I hate Jack. Oh, don't be stupid. No, he's such a dick. Just, just take no notes. No, but it's like the, like, can I tell you why I'm mad at him? Will you listen to me? Okay, please? okay, I'll, I'll listen. You know how Jack wants to be like Mr. Music Man and like be in the I music can't even, are you, are you, do you know when Jack wants to... You know to... how Jack wants to be in the music business and, like, yes, do what Mum yes, does eventually yes, yes, someday? Yes, I'm with you. And he's been working at Epic and whatever. Yeah. And... The first band that he, like, helped, I helped, whatever, I found. But he didn't give me or my friends who found them any credit for it, blah, 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 so blah, what, blah. What, 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 what do you want me to do? No, but listen, right? You, you can't work it out. Ignore it. What, 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 what can you do about it? What, what do you want me to do about it? Well, you know what you should do, Kel? I'm not being sarcastic. You should try and get your own thing going. I don't, I don't want my own thing going. I would just really appreciate some fucking credit. No, it's not that. I want to... Well, then, Kelly, what the fuck do you want me to do, Kelly? Do, what, what do, you, do you want me to do? you want me to go and say something to him? What do you want me to do, I Kelly? Sit there and tell me about how I'm not doing anything and I want you to make it for myself. I'm not Wobbler. Dad, listen to this. It's this sex advice thing on Buddy Head. It's on, a, on who? On, it's a website called Buddy Head. Hey, dude. I Buddy was, has. Buddy Head. Buddy Head. Yeah. Hey, dude. I was wondering if you were standing in a desert with no food or drink whatsoever, and you've been there for a few days, and someone came up to you out of nowhere and handed you a glass of cunt juice. Would you drink it? I, I wouldn't have to be in the pocket desert to drink some of that. I wanted to hear. I marked the best two down there. That's a lovely one. No, Mum. Mum, I look like a Uncle David with his twitch. I can't use that one. No, I hate that one. Kelly. It looks like God. Is that you? It's stupid. I hate it. I don't want my haha pictures. I hate that. Mum, you're retarded. I'm not liking that one. Stick that. that one's okay, look. It's upside down, Ozzy. Oh. Who knows how to make this thing work? I'm turning it on and it didn't work. Mum, how come you don't have to work right here? Don't play. Don't play. No, I'm not. Mum, what do you like me to show you how to work right here? Please. You plug it in, Mum? Yeah, I plugged it in. Step on that, it's supposed to work. No, don't. Press my button. How come none of us don't know how to work there? <laughs> Fucking hate the sound of button. That's not fair, you promise you won't say anything. Where am I? Where am I? 
What you do? I'll help you. I'm going to help. Oh, kill it. If I show you, you can't kill me. I'm going to show you. What. You're going to have a tattoo. Where? So ordinary, Kelly. I love it. We all got the same one. Yeah, let me see it, Kelly. <laughs> let me see it. your number. No, and you're not saying anything. That has to. Let me see it again, Kelly. So ordinary. I Kelly. love it. What are we going to do about a tattoo? You've got that there for the rest of your fucking life. So you've got, I'll be right. I like it. Tell you, Kelly, if you get that infection, that, that one got infected, this, this one went up one time, and my fucking arm came up like a balloon, and my fingers in it, I couldn't, couldn't move. It was breaking my mum's heart. Yeah, but you're not going to say anything. Yeah, but I have to. <laughs> Dad, you fucking <laughs> please. <laughs> Hold on, Kelly's got something to tell you. I got a tattoo. You are joking. No. What did you get? It's really tiny. What is it? A tiny little heart. Where? On my hip. And who did it? Some guy. What? Some guy. Oh, that that tells me a lot. Some guy. Would you put your father on? Yeah.